Hey kids, have I ever told you the story of how I got my dog Eli? It was back in the winter of 2012. I had just moved back into town, saw an ad in the paper, the house I went to had dogs, I named him Eli. The end. Wasn't that a great story? No? Oh, I was missing a beginning, middle, and end, you say? Okay, let me start over. It all started back in late December, early January of 2012-2013. I had just moved back from San Diego and was living with my parents. I was lonely and felt like I could use a companion. After none of my ads got filled on the dating website, I decided to start looking for a dog. I did not want just any dog. I wanted the dog to be a Labrador Retriever. I searched through the classifieds in the newspaper and found a six-month-old black lab. When I went to see the black lab, I noticed that it was still a puppy, but already pretty big. I decided that I wanted a younger puppy, so I kept looking. I looked at websites and saw a lot of good-looking puppies, but they were all too expensive. I kept checking the newspaper ads, but nothing was showing up for a puppy Labrador Retriever. I asked around from my friends to my teammates where they got their dogs, but either they weren't chocolate labs or they were too expensive. I looked and looked for a puppy lab for a decent price, but it seemed as if it was not meant to be. One day while looking through the paper, I saw an ad for a six-week-old chocolate lab. Just as I started to give up hope, this ad pops up, so I rushed over to look at this dog. At the house, I took one look at the chocolate lab, and it was love at first sight. It was the cutest puppy I had ever laid eyes on. I picked him up, held him in my arms, and we hit it off instantly. And the rest, kids, is history. Eli and I go everywhere together. He is my best friend and I'm his. We go fishing, on walks together, and even go swimming. He can be a bit of a bed hog and even ruin new shoes, but finding Eli has brought great joy to my life. And that, kids, is how I met my dog Eli. Was that a better story? I agree. Having a clear beginning, middle, and end really helps build a story's clarity. Okay. <gasps> mm.